Here are some tips and tricks for using your Texas Instruments graphing calculator to save time and avoid mistakes. Now, let's take it to the test. Let's look at solving systems of linear equations involving two variables. Check out this first example. On a calculator page, press Menu, select Algebra, and the Solve Systems of Linear Equations feature, and Enter. That opens this dialog box. Leave the defaults for number of equations and variables. Those are standard for big exams. Press Enter to open this template. Plug in your equation, 2x plus 5y equals 10. Arrow down and enter the second equation. y equals x minus 5. And enter. The handheld shows 5, 0. Algebraically, substituting 5 for x and 0 for y into both equations would result in true statements. The solution is 5, 0, which means these lines intersect at that point. Let's try it again. I'm going to go a little faster this time. Solve this system, follow the menu to the template, plug in your equations, and enter. Aha! No solution found, which means there's no x-y pair that satisfies both equations. Okay, let's do one last example. Follow along. Enter the equations. Notice the bottom equation is the top equation multiplied by 2. They're the same line, so your handheld shows x in terms of y. So, the answer is infinite solutions. Great! Now you know how to use the System of Equations Solver. The Tips and Tricks document has all this and more. Download it now and use it to practice for the test. And be sure to check out the rest of the Tips and Tricks for Test Success videos. And hey, good luck on that exam!